it has to do with the relationship between the price of a security, its risks, and its expected return. And there are really sort of two key takeaways, if you will. One is that in that setting, the most efficient strategy for an investor is to hold basically a broadly diversified portfolio reflecting the market of securities that are available. Uh, and that gave birth to the notion of index funds. And the second is that there will be a reward in higher expected return, not guaranteed, but expected uh, for bearing risk, but the kind of risk for which the reward should be available is the risk of doing badly in bad times.